Hey, what is going on, guys? My name is Dale, and I bring you guys another Battle Beach. Um, what is this? Battle Beach episode. <laughs> like, what the heck is this? Fifty percent more quicksilver with any with your purchase. Battle while supplies last. So we get fifty percent more. Well, that's nice. Except for I don't have any money right now, so that's key. Okay. So how much should you get? Two fifty plus one twenty-five. Six hundred plus three hundred. Ooh. How much do these are worth? Oh, the next one's 500, and then it's probably 1,000. Okay, I'm just, I'm looking at stuff here real quick. Um, okay, so we have 500. Basically, we need 500, but I'm not going to do that. Just kidding. Yeah, that's still too much. No. Still too much money. Okay, my name is Dale, and I bring you guys an episode of Battle Beach. This is, I don't know what episode this is. It's been a week. Been over, actually, it's been over a week since I made it. Almost probably two weeks. I don't know how long it's been since I made an update video. But, um... I did finally, I think I started getting attacked when I guys left off, but I did get attacked a lot. Um, I lost some of them. A lot of them I've actually been winning, so I have a good setup on my base, actually. Apparently I have a good setup because a lot of people can't get through my base at all. Like, I haven't, I don't even think I would watch this one. So these people will come in, but I think I them off quick. Holy crap. That guy put them in a good spot. Because my guys are just taking them. That's what I have. Two sniper towers. Alright, anyways. I just want to see. Okay, let's get started. Alright, so since it's been a little bit over a week. I don't know where I left, left off last. So, um, what I've basically been doing is upgrading my uh, um, diamond mines. Upgrading them to level 9. It's been taking a... It took a long time to upgrade this level 9. It took a lot of time. What I don't like is that when you, okay, you have to click info to see what the next thing would be, which is kind of annoying, but that's alright. So, what I've been doing was upgrading these um to level 9, and that took most of the time because it took, how much time does it take? Four days, yeah, see it takes five days to upgrade these. That's just crazy. I guess it's pretty much like jungle heat, but whatever. So what I've done was I went and upgraded my diamond mines to mostly level 9. These three are level 9, and these two are still level 8. And I don't see a difference in between. Oh, okay, I see it. There's gears right here compared to that one. That's cool. Cool, cool. So then um, I also finished upgrading. Um, I also upgraded the headquarters to level 6 the other day. And that's finally done. So then after I upgraded to level 6, I was able to get another diamond mine and a lava collector. So I just added those two in, and I think I don't I hadn't upgraded them yet. No, because I'm upgrading these diamond mines or diamond vaults right now, so that way I can upgrade this again. Because I'll be able to upgrade these headquarters. Because look how much diamond I have. I have 415 diamond right now. So what I'm trying to do is upgrade these diamond vaults so I can upgrade the headquarters to level seven and get the, that upgrading these out of the way, which would be nice. Um, I know I have to click the info button. It's crazy. So it's going to take seven days. Woo! Pretty much seven days. That's just great. Awesome. So the setup, I wasn't really... I mean, I didn't expect it to be this like this. Um, I was just messing around, and then I think it's actually kind of a good setup. I mean, I don't get attacked that much. Um, so, I mean, it doesn't really matter about the setup too much. Once I start losing a lot, then I'll start changing it. Because if you go in the shop, I don't have... I'm able to put a lot more defenses down, or not really, but I can put a mortar down, um, service to air missile, and a grenade tower missile silo. So, oh my god, my fishies are hungry. That's my girlfriend, she plays the fish games. Fishy games. Um, so, that's basically what I've been doing there. Um, I had this, my lava collectors were full, I had 520, or I had 520,000, so what I did was I started upgrading my military academy and my barracks. So my barracks are at level 7 right now. Which is pretty ridiculous. So I have um, pretty much all of these unlocked now from just one tower. So then what I went and did was once I upgraded those, I upgraded these guys and or this, and I researched um, these two dudes because they go for the, t the resources first, and then after that they go after whatever else. So what I have, so basically what I do, can do is I can add more barracks and. Um, Parade ground. I didn't know that's what it was called. 
because there's not a lot of space in here because it's only level three. So that's basically what I was doing here. And I was going to change this to edit. So that BBB, I was gonna do Droid Army based on my channel. Because it's like Android Army, but instead of Android, I'm gonna Droid Army. So that's what we're gonna do here. Um, I don't know how you invite people. If somebody tells me, if somebody can let me know how you invite people, that would be nice because I don't know how to invite people because I haven't figured it out. So we're gonna change this to Droid Army and then we're going to um, start, I'm gonna start inviting people if I can do it because I know I can, because this is the Lion's name. I don't think these are players because these are just alliances. So I don't know how you can invite people. That's what I'm trying to figure out. I don't know how to do that. So if you guys can tell me, no, let me know because there's a couple people that want to join my um, thing, but I don't know how to invite people. Maybe you have to go in here and uh, click the players because then when you click the players, you can, or no. The only reason, that, the only way I figured it out was doing it this way. And when you're in the global chat, you can click on their name and then invite to Alliance. I don't think I, that might be the only way you can do it, but I don't know how you get messages either. If it, I don't know if you can send messages to players or whatever. I'm not sure. So if you guys can let me know in the comments how to invite people, that would be nice. So I can invite people to my clan here so we can get our clan started because I'm still waiting for the jungle heat update so I can start inviting people there. Hopefully I can figure it out because I have a lot, a lot of requests to join that game. So hopefully there's enough space for everybody. It's probably going to be a 50 person limit. Hopefully not. But we'll see. Because, um, I don't know, we'll just see. We'll see when that, that happens. But So I'm thinking, I think that's the only way you can do it. I'm not sure. So if somebody let me know in the comments and then maybe I'll have to... I don't know, we'll have to figure it out. We'll figure it out. So just somebody let me know if they know how to do it, because I have not figured it out, if they have their own clan or something. Um, and then we'll just go from there, because I don't know how to do it in um, edit mode. I forgot about that edit mode thing. So then what I've been doing also is I've been upgrading these walls. Maybe that's why he sent those tanks in over there because the walls are upgraded to level 5. So I'm starting to upgrade the walls too. That's the other thing I was trying, starting to do. But instead of upgrading the walls, I'm going to save money to upgrade the town hall to level 7. And then we'll go from there. Because you can, I can also build more um, walls. And I have space for walls too. But I don't know what to do with them. I might just extend it outwards. Like if I extend these walls this way, then I can put more stuff right here. And if I do it this way too, I can put more stuff right here. Maybe that's what I'll do, but not sure yet. I have no, I don't really play this game too much compared to the other games. I just kind of upgrade stuff and then leave and come back and then upgrade more stuff and leave and just let it go. Because I don't really pay attention to this game as much. It's still pretty fun, but you know, whatever. Um, so basically, that is it for this episode. Just my diamonds are all upgraded to level 9. These are all still at level 7. The lava collectors, this one's, these are also level 9. Um, I, the only thing I've been concentrating on was upgrading the diamond mines, and I also upgraded these because I didn't, I didn't, I had lava to spend, and I didn't know what to spend it on, so I just upgraded this stuff. And since I have three workers, and it takes forever to upgrade one thing, it's going to take a while. Like this lava collector, I started upgrading to level 8 the other day because it takes what three days pretty much two days four hours whatever three days and so yeah it takes a while to upgrade all these once you're all higher levels so i only have three workers to work with because it's too too expensive to buy more quicksilver i'm not gonna spend that much money twenty dollars i'm probably only be able to get like two workers but or one more worker actually i don't know actually you know what because it's only 500 i don't know I'm not going to spend it. I don't really pay attention to this game that much. I'm just going to upgrade it. And then that's that. So basically that's it for this episode. I um, hope you guys are enjoying it. I also did add in the grenade tower here. And a mortar here. Because a lot of, when I got attacked a lot of people sent in big groups of people at one time. So I put the mortar in so they can destroy the big, big groups of people. And then the grenade tower. I'm not sure why I put this one over here. I forgot what it does. Um, 
but it hits the ground. Oh yeah, that's why I think I put it there. I put that there because it hits ground and air targets. Um, except for I need one of those over here too because this doesn't hit the ground and air targets. I don't think. Yeah, see that just hits that. So I might put a surface to air missile over here somewhere. I'm not sure. So basically that's it for this episode. Hope you guys enjoy it. Um, and be sure to let me know how to invite people because a lot of people want to join the clan, but um, I haven't figured it out yet. So. That's it for this one. It's a little shorter than all the other videos, but there's not much more to talk about. Just upgrading stuff here and there. So hope you guys enjoy it. My name's Dale. Um, peace out and see you guys in the next video.